Okay, so for a hollow sphere, the moment of inertia at its center will be I equal to 2 over 3 mR square, right? But now, the moment we are looking for the moment of inertia on its surface. So there's a, a distance r between the center and the surface. So the new moment of inertia should plus the mass times the distance between the new the new rotating axis to the center of the mass, which is the mr square. We can get 5 over 3 mr square. Right? So that's the new moment of inertia. And we know that the period equal to 2 pi square root moment of inertia over mass gravitational acceleration d distance, which is radius in our case, plug in the number 2 pi or pi. This is going to be 5 mr square mgr, right? mm canceled. R cancel, so we get sorry. There's a three here. So it can be two pi square root five r over g. So applying the number, we'll get zero point five eight 